like and subscribe, yeah! Hey kid, I don't normally do shout outs, but... I'd like to dedicate this story to all you insomniacs, night owls, and rock stars who get on up when the sun goes down. This one's for you. Hoo hoo! You know who you are. It's me. Also me. Hoo hoo hoo! Also me. Eh, 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 eh. Count me in, because when everyone's asleep, I'm awake and eating their cheese. Eh, 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 eh. But if everyone's awake, what are they doing? Oh, by the looks of the cover, engaging in mayhem. I'm in. No, we're in. Let's go. Oh. Look how beautiful. Is this perhaps where our story takes place? In this lighthouse home at the edge of a wood overlooking this placid blue lake? But it seems like the lights are out. Did no one give them the memo that everyone's awake? Mm -hmm. The crickets are all peeping. The moon shines on the lake. We should be soundly sleeping. But everyone's awake! Lights on! Everybody's home! Dad had done the dishes. Mom had locked the doors. I was snuggled up in bed, listening for the snores of all my fellow housemates, till it occurred to me that all my fellow housemates were as wakeful as could be. What gave it away, kid? The giant beam of light coming in from the hallway? Or perhaps there is noise coming from outside. Grandma's at her needlework. Dad is baking bread. My brother's making laundry lists of every book he's read. Seriously, I've never even done that. What has he read? Is it, okay, let's see, here's the, the Wildwood Chronicles, The Nest, Ivy and Bean, Peter Pan, The Nutcracker, we've read that. Okay, this list just goes on and on and Matilda. Okay, it's it's a good list. It's a it, let's just say it's it's solid. Moving on. Sisters flossing braces and reciting Baudelaire while she's locked inside the bathroom, tying plates into her hair. Sure, a little midnight dental hygiene. Why not? We all got tucked in early. A full tomorrow waits. But here, it's almost midnight. Dung. And everyone's awake. And what is Grandma doing? What is she up to? She's got this long dress, and she looks like she's in a hurry to go somewhere. What are you up to, Grandma? This is no hour to be going out. <laughs> the cat is running circles while the mice are playing cards. <laughs> Deal me in, fellas. <laughs> There's some unholy racket being made out in the yard. Oh, you know, nothing to see here, really. It's just a ghost ship being raised from the bottom of the lake because that's completely normal. The dog's into the egg knock. Oh, mom's tap dancing to Prince while dad is on the laptop buying 10-yard bolts of chintz. And, oh. Looks like he's on uh, Ratazonk also, and uh, we're partying like it's 1999. My brother's now reciting every line from Condor Man while my sister is trapezing from the kitchen ceiling fan. Oh, 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 sorry, Taylor, that is not safe. No, you're right, Doug, that is not safe. Do not try that at home. Dad just rolled the motorbike into the living room vroom, vroom, and is practicing Sinatra with a handle of the broom. Fly me to the moon and let me play among the stars. <laughs> Let's pause for a moment to admire the rat on the bike. Oh, white rat, do you happen to know that guy? <laughs> I am that guy. <laughs> 
I cannot think what happened to make us act this way. We were all feeling drowsy at the dimming of the day, but now nobody's sleeping. Everyone's awake. However will we function in the morning for Pete's sake? And, uh... Nothing really interesting to see here. Just Grandma apparently cavorting with the Captain Ghost from the ghost ship that just came up from the bottom of the lake. Just hanging out with some strange ghost in the middle of the night, Grandma. What's up with you? Mom is on the rooftop fixing broken slates. You go, girl! And brothers in the kitchen juggling the plates. Sisters donned a headband and is prepping for a run. While not asleep, we all at least are getting some things done. Oh, this is a very productive household. Uh, getting things done like the cat chasing the mice and a little indoor gardening and some porch ghost dancing. Grandma's on to play whist with long dead Grandpa Paul and the dog has started throwing darts against my bedroom wall. You know this book is crazy when the most interesting thing on the page is not the dog throwing darts, but Grandma's actually been hanging out all this time with the long dead Grandpa Paul who was a captain on that ghost ship at the bottom of the lake and they reunite at night and play cards and have cake and reunite with all this love and happiness and okay, Grandma, I was worried you were hanging out with ghost strangers. I should have known better. Now, Mom just took an audience with Queen Sigrid the Third. My brother has just taught the cat a dozen dirty words. Like, uh oh, dusty and poop and muddy and poopy and grimy and poopity. Okay, Duck Dinosaur and Green Bear, thank you for the dirty word tutorial. You're welcome. And poopity poopity poop. Will we ever settle? Will we ever sleep? Or will we be reduced into a shambling, sleepless heap? And meanwhile, there's whack and spin and glug glug and whiz and thwack and hee hee and ha ha and thawk and screech going on. I'm really not quite certain how much more that I can take. I think that we may just become forever everyone away. It's really looking that way. Yeah, Red Bear, it really is looking that way. But look, sisters on a quiz show. Dad is digging jazz with a spatula ribbit. Grandma singing Clementine with unabashed pizzazz. My brothers built a temple from discarded toothpaste pops ribbit. While the cat is giving poke tattoos and prank calling the cops. Okay, you know that whoever gave the dog darts also gave the cat a cell phone. My mom just won a Pulitzer. Dad sailed off to war. Ahoy! Grandma's joined a miming troupe. Who even knows what for? My brother staged a coup d'etat and overthrown the state. While my sister joined the resistance. They never got on great. So now we are having a full-scale war in the living room with with frog versus mice, and, and brother versus sister, and dog versus cat, which is the only thing that even remotely makes sense. Mom has forced a treaty. Dad just annexed France. Grandma's built a Goodyear blimp from Dad's old underpants. Ribbit. Well, that's recycling. And me? Well, I'm just lying here awake inside my bed. Blink, blink thinking I should just get up and write a book instead. Well, kid, if anyone's family was ever book worthy, that one is. Hey, what's all this? What's happened now? What light through window breaks? The morning's come, the night is through. Let's hear no belly aches. But just as I walk from my room and down the staircase creep, rip it. I find the sun is shining down on everyone asleep. I'm going to wake them. Don't you dare. I'm about to. One, two. No, 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 no. The night people must be respected. So everyone, good night. Or...
If you are one of those early rising, sunrise loving morning people, you know who you are. Yup, yup, yup. <laughs>